Dear Dr. King, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for being so caught up with the lives on social media that I forgot about the lives that fought for the one that I have today. I'm sorry that as a fourth year student at a predominantly white university that you and so many others fought for me to attend that I'm just now marching in honor of your name. I'm sorry, but I'm also thankful. I'm thankful that I was able to witness the coming together of people for a cause that we all can identify with. Dr. King, did you know it gets cold on your birthday? Did you know because of your phenomenal impact, the temperature could never hinder people from gathering at the foot of your statue? Did you know while in the courtyard, there were several occasions when the sprinklers started going off, but that didn't stop us from coming back together. It kind of reminds me of the riots in 1963 when fire hoses were used to spray civil rights protesters. It didn't stop them either. So many people spoke in honor of your name. The leader of African American Diaspora Studies, Brenda Burt, and the president of UT, Gregory Finvez spoke about your heroism that continues to pave the way for generations after generations. At the march, a young boy named Makai Muhammad gave a speech. He was no older than 10, but yet his presence was so vigorous and his words were so powerful that even you will feel chills down your spine. Despite your hard work, did you know that your statue is only on the grounds of three colleges? I think we can do better. The theme for today was the courage to love. You said, I have decided to stick with love. Hate is too great a burden to bear. But how could you not hate those that thought it was a bearing of a burden to love you? I wish you could teach me. Your fraternity brothers led the march. They stood tall and confident, knowing that they will forever have a special bond that ties you and them together. They represent some of our strongest black men today. I think you will be proud. We marched from the University of Texas campus to the state capitol, where we met up with more supporters to commemorate your achievements. I don't know if you guys can see it, but there is a huge amount of thousands of people coming in from the University of Texas campus right now. Now, this is the first time They sung you happy birthday and other songs. Did you know there was a choir and live band all for you? Despite the obstacles we all face, your legacy still brings joy. We marched from the Capitol to Houston Tillotson. As we walked the streets, the view of thousands marching in your name was breathtaking. It's crazy to think that you have led thousands in a march for justice and today we are able to march for you and so much more. The celebration concluded at Houston Tillotson with more music and food, of course. At the park, Babu Blake performed with his band. One of their songs, Paging Dr. King was a crowd favorite. It brought light to the idea that we live in a world so different from the one you envisioned. We're caught up with so many wrong things that we've lost sight of what's important, the future. So today was my first day marching for something. And I feel so stupid only because I've chosen to remain ignorant to you and the adversity that our people are facing today. So for that, I'm sorry. Sincerely, Jalen Jackson. I don't think this is the dream you gave us the speech about your boys a paper chasing nowadays and they ain't reaching out. Hey. Seem like we only find a cause for applause. You and Mapham led us to rest. Just jack they jaws. Deep rose still going to church. Be included. Ain't nobody too concerned with the movement. Just where the food is. We just making 40 acres in 50 years. No, we hanging ourselves. Master be like, here's road. It's like we live to hang and stay up to date on our clothes, our cologne, our slang, ride, ride around town, load a truck full of pain, smoking rod, drink away, pain, try to stay sane. I'm saying, Dr. King, if you don't answer my page, my 
my daddy say we live in a whole different age indeed the times have changed but it's nothing new under the sun it's on us it ain't up to you Hello. huh <laughs> tom watts page of dr king huh <laughs> <laughs>